This is Bangu the Flying Fox, a dreamtime story of the Yuan people of Wally Lake, a story retold by Julianne Taylor and illustrated by Penny Jones and Aaron Norris. The book was published by the Aboriginal Studies Press. Long ago, when the world was new, there were many birds and there were many animals on the earth. The birds and animals spent most of their time fighting one another. Bangu the flying fox couldn't make up her mind if she was a bird or an animal. Bangu the flying fox liked to be on the winning side all the time. When she went out to play with the other animals and they got into a fight with the birds, Bengu would change to the birds' side if they were winning. If she was with the birds and the animals were winning, she'd change to the animals' side. One day, the birds and animals became really sick of this and had a big meeting. They were fed up with Bengu pretending to be one of them and changing sides. They called her over and told her off, and... Just to get the message across, they gave her a good hiding to go along with. They said, go away. You are not a bird, you are not an animal, and we don't want to play with you again. So Bengu crept away, and that's why you only see her come out at night and fly around by herself. If you find friends, stick to them. Help them when things are good and when things are bad. Because if you keep changing sides and letting your mob down, you'll end up as lonely as Bangu, the flying fox. And that was the story of Bangu, the flying fox. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. Thank you for reading along.